Beaumont firefighters rescued a dog from a hot car while the owner was inside Parkdale Mall. Investigators say the temperature inside a vehicle is usually 20 degrees higher than the temperature outside. Police arrived at the shopping center at about 1230 Sunday and found a poodle locked inside a silver Yukon. Firefighters were able to unlock the SUV and free the dog that was locked inside a travel carrier. The dog did not have any water. Officials said the windows were cracked about a half an inch, but it's not enough to keep air circulating inside the SUV. Investigators believe the temperature inside the vehicle could have reached 103 degrees. A woman noticed the dog and called 911. My dogs are like my children, so I would definitely, would you leave your child in a car? You know, no, you wouldn't. So um, people should think, you know, if, if, it's, if you're going to be more than just a couple minutes, um, you should definitely just leave it at home. At the time of the rescue, the owner of the dog had not come outside. Animal Services did leave a note inside the car along with an information brochure on the dangers of leaving pets inside hot cars. Leaving a pet inside a hot car is against the city ordinance. The owner faces a $500 fine and must meet with Animal Services before taking the dog home. Parents of a 10-year-old Beaumont boy brought their son to a local hospital after he was bit on the leg by a German shepherd. Beaumont Animal Services said the boy was in the 1800 block of Corley riding his bicycle when the dog bit his calf. Investigators said the boy and his parents were visiting someone in that area. It happened at about 4 o'clock Saturday evening. The dog owner has until 10 a.m. Monday to get it tested for rabies. If the owner does not bring the dog to a veterinarian, Beaumont Animal Services will quarantine the dog.